Tonight, he's a true Kentucky journalist. Former WHAS TV reporter and Courier Journal columnist Byron Crawford was honored tonight at the Frazier Museum. As part of the program, they played one of Byron's best known stories that aired here on WHAS 11 in the early 70s. Homer has only one claim to fame. He can imitate a chainsaw. <laughs> Byron is out with a new book called The Back Page and currently writes for Kentucky Living Magazine. On WHS TV, his stories were called Side Roads. He traveled all over Kentucky telling amazing stories and, of course, wearing a fishing hat that became just as famous. And they showed off that famous hat at tonight's sold-out event. There it is. Byron took questions from Rachel Platt of the Frazier and Joe Arnold of Kentucky Electrical Cooperatives who asked him how he found those stories. I would walk into a country store sometime in the state and someone would have written a phone number and name down on a paper bag, a brown paper bag. <laughs> I got mail from people uh, and phone calls from every kind of a way you could get a message. The program included old promotional photographs of Byron during his time on Channel 11 before going to the Courier Journal. And as part of tonight's program, it was a true honor for me to tell the story of how I would watch Byron as a kid at home with my parents, my early days of wanting to work here so badly. Byron's son and daughter also talk, uh, talked about great stories about their father. His book is available right now.